Hi guys, welcome to a new video. My name is Polar, and now I'm gonna show you how to install Vanilla Twix Data Pack in Minecraft 1.20 and 1.20.1. Also, work for all Minecraft versions, so don't worry if you're watching this tutorial in Minecraft 1.20.2. First, you need to know that for install these data packs in your world on in a multiplayer world, first you need to have WinRAR in your PC. So if you don't have it, don't load it. I leave you the link in the description. Just follow the steps what the websites. You. Now I'm gonna show you the tutorial for solo world. Also, I'm gonna show you the tutorial for a multiplayer world like Eternals. So if you want to skip this part, go to the menu that I'm leaving you in the screen right now. But if you want to add it in a solo world, stay with me. First, go to Google and search for this website, Vanilla Twix. I leave you the link in the description. Here, select this option, data packs, and here, select all the data packs that you want. I personally recommend you this data pack. Unlock all recipes. Then you can choose the other data packs that you probably want, like durability pin, multiplayer sleep, or any one. I love this data pack too, larger phantoms and dragon drops. But you can choose all you want. Armored Elytra looks beautiful, I think that I like it, and just search the data packs that you want. Once you have choose all the data packs that you want, do this. Go to download, but don't click on download. Click to this arrow. And here click on direct download. Nice, now you have your file downloaded. Now just follow my steps. Click on the Windows key and the R key at the same time in your keyword. And here write percent app data, like this. And then click on OK. Here select this folder, point Minecraft and then select this other folder open this other folder this one save here double click and nice here you have to select the world that you want to add these data packs in my case this one add it here you can go to your world and change the name to locate it better so nice double click in the world that you want and here search for this folder data packs double click and nice. Now you have to add this file here. How so easy? Right click on downloads, open in new window and drag the file. Nice. Once you drag it, do this. Right click and click on extract here. Once you have it extracted, you have all the data packs. Now just delete this folder, the first folder. Vanilla tweaks on me. Nice. And nice, now open your wall. Nice, once in your wall, check that you have all these data packs and they are working perfect. Like if you have local recipes, open your menu and you will see that you have all the recipes in your menu. So nice guys, this is the tutorial for solo wall. Now I'm gonna show you how to add these data packs in your Aternos or your multiplayer wall. So let's get started. First go to Google. Once in Google, go to Vanilla Twix website. I leave you the link in the description where you can search it in Google. Here, select this option, Data Packs. Click it, and here select all the data packs that you want. I personally recommend you this data packs. Unlock all recipes, multiplayer sleep, classic fishing loot, armored elytra, lager phantoms, and dragon drops. But you can choose any data pack any data pack that you want. Nice, once you have selected all the data packs that you want, do this. Go to download, but don't click on download. Click on this arrow, and here click on direct download. And nice, now you have your vanilla Twix file downloaded. Now you have to add it in your Eternos wall. Oh, so easy. Or your multiplier wall. You just need to search for a folder that says data packs. In the case of Eternos, it's in the walls option, but like in another hostings, like server pro probably is on files okay so just search for this file for the data packs file in your wall so click on worlds then click on files here and here click on data packs nice on this folder nice and you will have this folder empty now you have to add your data packs how oh, so easy go to your downloads folder and here do this. Select the file that you have downloaded and right click and click the right click. Okay? Here select this option. Extract in and the folder name. Just select this option. And now you will have this folder. Just open it and here you will have all the data packs that you want to add. So select all 
like this and then drag it here and nice now you have all your data packs in your Eternos wall this is the same way to add data packs in all hosting minecraft in all minecraft hostings just search the data packs folder and here add all the data packs nice now open your server and check that all is going in the right way okay hey i know the tutorial is working for you so now please subscribe and activate the notification bar by the way i have created a discord community channel so if you want to join i'll leave you the link in the description thanks nice now open your minecraft wall and once in your minecraft wall check that you have all the data packs if you have added the unlock all recipes data pack is so simply to check that all these data packs is working are working just click on your menu and check that you have all your recipes if you have it all the data packs are working so nice guys i know the tutorial works for you so please subscribe and leave a like this is all for today i leave you on the left a minecraft tutorial playlist and on the right a minecraft tutorial check them out right now my name is polar see you soon bye bye